This figure is a circle center O. QR is the diameter of the circle, and PQR is a triangle. If PQ is equal to 24 units and PR is equal to 7 units. Find the area of the shaded portion. The area of the shaded portion is equal to the area of the semicircle minus the area of triangle PQR. The area of the semicircle is equal to 1 over 2 pi radius squared. To find the radius of the semicircle, first let's focus on triangle PQR. In triangle PQR, angle RPQ is equal to 90 degrees. Reason from the circle theorem of angle in a semicircle, which states that the angle in a semicircle is right angle, that is 90 degrees. This follows that triangle PQR is a right triangle. So, from Pythagoras' theorem, RQ squared is equal to RP squared plus PQ squared. RP is equal to 7. And PQ is equal to 24. Substituting these values in the formula will give us RQ squared is equal to 7 squared plus 24 squared. 7 squared is equal to 49. And 24 squared is equal to 576. 49 plus 576 is equal to 625. So, RQ squared is equal to 625. Taking the square root of both sides will give us RQ is equal to 25. Since RQ is the diameter of the semicircle, it follows that the radius is equal to 25 divided by 2, which is equal to 12.5. If we substitute the radius with 12.5, the area of the semicircle will be 1 over 2 pi times 12.5 squared. 12.5 squared is equal to 156.25. It follows that the area of the semicircle is equal to 1 over 2 pi times 156.25. 156.25 divided by 2 is 78.125. Hence, the area of the semicircle is equal to 78.125 pi square units. Next, let's find the area of triangle PQR. The area of triangle PQR is equal to 1 over 2 times RP times PQ. RP is equal to 7. PQ is equal to 24. If we plug in these values in the formula, the area of triangle PQR will be 1 over 2 times 7 times 24. 24 divided by 2 is 12. And we are left with 1 times 7 times 12, which is equal to 84 square units. Now we know the area of the semicircle and the area of triangle PQR. Let's go ahead and find the area of the shaded portion. The area of the shaded portion is equal to 78.125 pi minus 84. If we take pi to be 3.14, it follows that the area of the shaded portion is equal to 78.125 times 3.14 minus 84. 78.125 times 3.14 is equal to 245.3125. And 245.3125 minus 84 is equal to 161.3125. Hence, the area of the shaded portion is approximately 161.31 to two decimal places. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe for more.